Hey guys, me and David. It's Friday night. Um, it is 5 15 2020, so I thought I'd do a little video. It is beer night. I'm having a few beers and trying to relax a little bit because it's the weekend and stuff, and um, things are starting to open up here in Minnesota as far as the virus goes. You know, they're, they're going to open up things, but they are going to keep the state parks closed until June 1st which you know I told you guys that I got an email a little bit ago that you know a few days ago or whatever that they're gonna refund my money for my for my campsite we we're supposed to go camping last week and they're gonna refund my money on the news they said that they were gonna refund it electronic gift card it's like I don't want a gift card I want my 40 bucks back you know so anyway I was uh, <laughs> I was you know I was on a call tonight just a few minutes ago just for a few minutes and you know sometimes I pop on and try to get you know I mean it's hard to get good information there's so many perps on these calls and the, the perps control these calls and they have to control these calls they have to control the conversations and all that stuff you know so uh, Brian too hopped on the call and you know when that happens when he hops on the call the perps come out. The perps come out. You can tell, you know, all these people are perps. They're interrupting him. They're doing all this stuff. They're, you know, uh, doing all this stuff, you know. I mean, they're all perps. They they come out when someone like that comes on the, on the call that's trying to give good information. They don't want you to get that good information, you know. So if you're, if you're, if you're, on a call with 40 or 50 people you know and nobody talks except the same damn people every single night they control the calls they say they're BS and they give it misinformation and all this stuff you know you know and those calls are bad if you can't recognize those calls you know they are bad but you know I mean if you can if you realize what's going on and all that stuff um, rarely is there any real TIs talking I'm not saying everyone's a perp on those calls I'm saying the people that are talking are perps they have to control that call it has to be that way you know so they control the narrative of that call they control the conversation they control everything of that call they're being scripted on what to do you know but when someone like Brian two hops on the call oh my god they they all come out against him you know and they you know if you want to know who's a perp and who's not they all come out against him when he hops on these calls you know it's unreal they they're like vultures in the middle of the street attacking a carcass you know what I mean I mean there you got all these vultures a group of vultures eating dead meat off the street you know what I mean it's unreal it really is unreal so anyway besides that um so I thought I'd do a little video um you know I'm kind of yeah I got hit a little bit today and stuff I took Tanner out and stuff like that and uh um you know, I you know I wanted to go camping. Um, now I have to wait till next month to go camping. I want to take Tanner camping and see how he does. He's about nine or ten months old right now, um, and we need a break from this place. Um, I don't know why they're laying it on so hard with me. Um, you know, like I said, they they gave me a couple years off, a couple years off. And then they start hitting me last year, and then they're hitting me good this year with no breaks. You know, I mean, they gave me a little break. I guess there was a little spot where they gave me a week off from getting hit. You know, but, but these guys love to hit you. You know, they love to F up your life. You know, they want to F up your life. They're so damn hateful. I've never seen people so damn hateful in my life. They hate everything. 
They hate everybody. They hate their life. You know, they hate everything. You know, these people are crazy. <laughs> you know, pretty much. But anyway, um, so I got hit a little bit. Um, a lot, of, you know, a little remote monitoring and all that stuff. They woke me up at four in the morning, and I was up at four in the morning. I was up until. Oh, I don't know, probably 9 o'clock in the morning. Couldn't get back to sleep. And then I slept until 2.30 in the afternoon. I was so tired. I finally did get back to sleep. They let me get back to sleep, and I slept until 2.30 in the afternoon. You know, I put my headphones on, listen to static or whatever, whatever I'm listening to. So I can't hear the banging and all this other stuff, you know, that they do to interrupt your sleeping. Uh, you know and stuff and you know so I kind of had to put up with that today but it was a nice day out today and I took Tanner for for uh, I took him to the park and then I took him for a ride afterwards and stuff and uh, he's he's getting better you know he's only what nine ten months old he's you know he kind of starts crying a little bit in the van and stuff like that he's um you know, he, uh, he, I mean, he likes going for walks and stuff like that, but he's, he's, you know, he's, he's a little bit on the timid side. Um, I don't know why that is, you know, um, but he is on the timid side a little bit and, and stuff. I don't know why, but, um, other than that, uh, you know, I tried posting this video, um, uh, we had a, you know, we have the aerial lift bridge in our city. There's only a few lift, lift bridge, lift bridges, I guess, um, in the United States. And we have one in our city. Um, you know, so they had, they had the lights blue tonight and they were doing a parade of fallen cops, you know, fallen police officers that lost their lives and stuff like that. So th they had it on Facebook, and I took a little video of it, and I've been trying. I've been trying to post that video for probably an hour and a half. I cannot get that video up. I don't know if I'll be able to get this video up. Something is wrong, or they're trying to stop my video from uploading. You know, something's wrong there. I've never had this much trouble uploading a video before and stuff. So they had a big parade of cop cars, you know, for the fallen police officers and stuff like that, you know, and it was really cool. There was over a hundred, over a hundred police officers in our city that were doing this parade, you know, for the fallen. And, um, you know, in, you know, in stuff. So, you know, I've been trying to upload that video, um, you know, but I can't seem to upload it. Um, other than that, there's really not too much going on. I'm sitting here having a couple of beers and stuff, and I was on that call, and heard Brian too get on there, and oh my God, the perps came after him, boy. They come after him. They come after him. They don't want us to know that information that he's giving out. They do not want us to have that information. And if you ever ever have a question on who's a perp and who isn't, he hops on those calls and you got all the perps attacking him. They're like flies on shit, you know? I mean, really, it's like flies on shit. You know, all these low-level scumbag thugs going after him. That's what it is, really. I mean, in real reality, that's what it is, you know, and stuff. Um, you know, some people may disagree with me, but um, they're wrong, <laughs> you know. So anyway, um, so I thought I'd do a little video. Um, other than that, not too much to say. Uh, I, uh, you know, I slept in midnight till about 4 a.m. and then he started hitting me, waking me up, and I wasn't even tired and all this stuff try to get back to bed and it's just impossible to do um, I don't know you know it's just it, it, it bothers me that we can't get any help you know I mean nobody will help us nobody will help us you know I mean you know I was thinking today 
I was thinking, I was laying on my bed listening to the police scanner. And, um, you know, I was waiting for Tanner to eat his food and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, I was thinking today, I was, I was just, I was thinking, who has this much power? You know, I mean, who has this much power in our government to where they can control everyone? You know, um, you know, I mean, it, you know, it, you know, certain agencies are involved in our programs and all that stuff. And they're doing exactly what they're told. They, they act like they're walking on eggshells. You know, the perps in my program, they, they act like they're walking on eggshells. You know, they act like, if I don't do this, I'm going to be next. You know, they act scared as shit. You know, because if they don't do what they're told, they could be next. No problem. And they will ruin you. You know, so I was thinking today, who has this much power? You know, I mean, you got the president. The president acts like he has no power. You know, you have all these, you know, people in the military and, you know, all this stuff. You know, nobody acts like they have any power. You know, who carries all that power to where... You know, everyone in my program, they act like they're walking on eggshells for somebody, you know, and they act like if they don't do what they're told, guess what, buddy, you're next, you know, they own these people, they're like slaves, you know, it's just, it's really unreal, who has this much power in our government, you know, I don't know who it is, you know, but, but somebody has a hell of a lot of power in our government that is controlling this program, you know, and these elected officials and stuff like that, they don't have any power. They don't have any power. You know, you got the director of the CIA, you got the... Secretary of Defense, you have, you know, I mean, all these people act like they have no power. You know, maybe, maybe some of them are involved. I don't know. But, you know, somebody is controlling all these people. And somebody out there has a hell of a lot of power. You know, whether it's the military, I don't know who it is. But they have a lot of power to control these people. And they're slaves to this program. They're, you know, they're effed up. They're effed. You know, pretty much, you know, and they're doing what they're told because if they don't, they're going to be next. They're going to be next and their life is going to be ruined, you know, so, and that's the truth of it, you know. So, anyway, I'm going to probably cut this off. I'm kind of rambling on this video and uh, and stuff. So, I'm going to cut this off, you guys. Um, I hope you have a good night and I hope you have a good weekend and I will talk to you later.